Measurement update rules for base filters often contain handcrafted heuristics to compute the observation probability for high dimensional sensor data like images. In this work, we propose a novel approach, deep measurement update, as a general update rule for a wide range of systems. Deep measurement update has a conditional encoder decoder neural network structure to process depth images. The encoder network compresses the input image into a latent vector. The latent vector is augmented with a condition vector, in particular the particle state of a base filter. The augmented latent is then decompressed by the decoder and fed to the output module. In the output module, the L1 loss between the reconstructed image and the target image is computed. For training, the target image is a primed image with the same background as the input image, but a different state. We provide the primed state as the condition vector. When deploying as part of a particle filter, the target image is the same as the input with a network conditioned on the queried particle state. We use the loss as a likelihood measure between the particle states and the true ground truth state. Those likelihoods are used in the measurement update for the base filter. In an experiment, we use a particle filter to estimate the pose of a box, highlighted in green. The box is hidden behind an obstacle and not visible to the depth sensor. A second obstacle is present in the scene. The filter is initialized with 100 particles drawn from a normal distribution with 20 cm standard deviation in x direction. After a few deep measurement update steps, the particle distribution becomes bimodal with clusters of particles behind the two obstacles. Even though the target box is not visible yet, deep measurement update can leverage the knowledge of observed free space to eliminate some particles. We now remove one obstacle and reveal that the target object is not hidden behind it. The particle distribution collapses and only the particles behind the second obstacle remain. After removing the second obstacle, the target object becomes visible. The particle filter quickly converges to the ground truth state. We repeat the same experiment, but initialize the particle filter with the two-dimensional distribution for the object position. Again, the filter converges to the ground truth state once the target object is visible. 